just wanted to put a quick video together of this uh, flow through worm bin system that I put together. Um, I used uh, one by one mild steel. I had the inside sheeted and galvanized and the stainless rod is three eighths. I've got them set at uh, two inches on center on the grate below. The interior dimensions of the box are uh, two foot by four foot. It stands about uh, 36 inches high or so. And then I'm going to run a lid across the top here. I just need to configure something that's light enough. I don't want to use one by one because it's too heavy. I'll probably use some corner iron and then just run tabs so that I can screw the uh, the other sheet metal to it and put the insulation in it. Um, there's one inch insulation in here. I have uh, a couple of uh, uprights running in here so I section the front to give it a little more rigidity and uh, I sided it with corrugated metal. The uh, insulation is taped at the seams and uh, the foil side is out. I don't know if that makes any difference to anybody, but uh, I had considered a number of ways of doing this. I'd done it with the uh, string line trimmer, and uh, you know, as that works out, it's like uh, an old tennis racket. Racket starts to get uh, saggy in the middle and so forth. But uh, that unit that I built previously, that's two foot by six foot, is uh, being used on a friend's farm down in Southern California now, and it's still operational. So, you know, good for him. And uh, I've got uh, one bar in the middle just to keep this from ever sagging under the weight of all the uh, castings and the worm mass that will probably develop inside here. And uh, I think with the air gap in here, it won't get as hot if I have it sitting in any uh, partial sunlight. The, uh, the heat will be absorbed into the metal and then the airflow through there will keep it from getting hot in the interior. That's just my thinking. I'll have to uh, check that with the thermometer at a later date, but uh, that's uh, the new worm bin. I'll have to uh, start from scratch since uh, my source moved south, but uh, it uh, didn't take too long to build, and uh, probably the most labor-intensive part was drilling all these holes for the rivets and putting them in. I got a few more of those to go, but uh, if anyone's interested, I can draw out a sketch or something along those lines or give you a materials list and just leave a comment in the uh, box below. Up here on the top, I'm going to put in a screen, either uh, some mesh or uh, maybe expanded metal or something. I don't want birds being able to get into it or raccoons, but I just wanted the airflow so when I have a roof coming across like this, It'll uh, catch some breeze and help keep it cool and let the heat out too. Anyways, hope everyone's having a good day doing whatever they're doing. See ya.